Hey guys, Tim Pokemon here, and in today's video, we're going to be showing off my Pokemon Scarlet and Violet team. And yes, I built my team over the last week with the leaks that I've seen, and honestly, I cannot wait for these games. And yeah, I'm going to show off the team that I'm picking for this game, for these games, and honestly, I cannot wait. So comment down below, are you going Pokemon Scarlet or Pokemon Violet? I'm going Violet personally, and I cannot wait for these games. Two days away, it's crazy. Quick keyword, two days, because it's, it's, it's right there. And um, yeah, we're going to be celebrating with a stream on Friday. Two streams, actually. Um, so we're going to do one from midnight to 2 a.m. on drop day. Um, you know, like right at midnight, Eastern Standard Time, midnight to 2 a.m. We're going to be streaming. And we're going to be just streaming all the story. We're going to be trying to get through, maybe shiny hunt a little bit. But just trying to get through the story as much as we can. So that our second stream on the day, it's going to go from about 4 or 5 p.m. Um, Eastern Standard Time, make sure to follow me on Instagram. I will make official announcements there. Um, but 4 or 5 p.m. all the way to like midnight that night, we are going to be streaming and we're going to be going crazy for this game. I mean, oh, I cannot wait for this game. Uh, so make sure you guys come join me, shiny hunt with me. Um, we're going to be doing some co op stuff uh, with some subscribers. So if you do want to join me like that, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, message, me over, message me over on Instagram. We have a couple friends that we're already planning on, um, you know, uh, playing with. Uh, so co-op, we're going to take advantage of it right away. Quick keyword co-op, and I cannot wait for these games. I can't believe they're this close already. But let me show off my team to you guys. And let me know in the comments down below what your starter is, because mine is definitely Fue Coco. And I have seen the final evolution for the starters, and I'm still going with my boy Fue Coco. Quick keyword Fue Coco. And although I'm not like overly overly like a hundred percent love in the final evolution i think it's going to grow on me um i think all three of the final evolutions were a tiny bit of a letdown in my opinion at least um i think that sprigatitos was the most let down out of the three um but honestly uh when i put my poll up on the story fue coco was still first sprigatito second quaxley third i'm surprised quaxley's not getting more love I, I did really like the the evolution of quaxley as well that was my second choice in my opinion um when, when it was the first three starters i went Fue Coco, Sprigatito, Quaxley, but with the final evolutions, Quaxley and Sprigatito switch places. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, but let me know in the comments down below what your starter Pokemon is, and we're going to show Pokemon number two. Now, this one, I don't know how early we're going to be able to encounter it, but it's a Titan. Now, so Titan does have a pre-evolution Satoddle, and it is one of the cutest Pokemon I've ever seen. It's honestly so cute. I love it. It's shiny, it's good, everything. We're going to be shiny hunting this at some point. By the way, like I said, we are going to be shiny hunting specific Pokemon on streams as well. So Titan's one of them. Um, we 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 said we put out a list of like three or four, and uh, one of them is um, don't hate me, Fido. And you're like, oh, why why are you shiny hunting Fido? It's such a bad Pokemon. It's my dog. Okay, its evolution is a Dash Hound Pokemon. It is an evolution it's called Dash Bun. Um, I'm not going to show a picture, but it's literally my dog. It looks just like my dog. I have to get it. I have two Dash Hounds. Uh, for people that don't know dog names, that's uh, wiener dogs, <laughs> little hot dogs. I have two, and I have to ca I have to get the shiny Fido. So quickie word Fido, but it's not here um, because it's not going to stay on the team the whole time. Um, but we're going to make sure to get it for sure. Um, it's not like the greatest stat wise, but uh, stat wise, the Titan's a beast. It has like 170 HP or something like that in the in that stat. And it's got Slush Rust, I believe, as an ability. It's got pretty decent speed. And Snow is replacing Hail in these games. And it's buffing defenses for Ice types, which is pretty awesome. So, yeah. Uh, then we got Pokemon number three, and it's <sighs> Serilege. Yes. Um, this one, honestly, is just such a cool-looking Pokemon. Once every, I feel like everybody, once they saw it revealed, was like, oh, we're going Violet. And I'm not going to lie, some of the Paradox forms for um for for scarlet are better than violet i'm not even gonna lie to you guys they are really nice paradox forms in these games and um i think I, I think scarlet got the better end of that but sarah ledge is a beast it's shiny isn't the best shiny ever but it is still pretty nice and this pokemon in general just looks so cool so it, it does have a pre-evolution actually as well uh, then we got our next Pokemon, Belly Bolt. Yes, uh, Belly Bolt will be on the team at least for a little bit, guaranteed. Um, this thing is just so cute. It's a Squishmallow. We're going to shiny hunt this at some point. It's got a pretty nice shiny. It kind of turns like a neon color, which is pretty nice. I like it. I, I, I like this Pokemon anyways. Look, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you guys right now, I love derpy Pokemon. Um, Pokemon that just look derpy are like some of my favorites. So quick keyword, Belly Bolt. Um, if you guys misspell it, that's okay. But let me know what you guys are bringing on your team. If you guys, um, you know, out of the Pokemon revealed so far, what Pokemon are you bringing on your team? Um, another Pokemon I'm definitely bringing on my team, um, at least at some point in the game, is Paldean Wooper and its evolution. Um, Claude Sire, I believe is the name. 
and it, it is quick keyword whooper. It is so derpy, but I love it. It is so good, and um, it, it actually I believe is a little bit better than um nor like Quagsire. So it's it's gonna be pretty interesting. It's also pretty bulky, so my team's gonna be hard to take out, I guess. But uh, yeah, it, it's just. It's a great Pokemon, right? It's it's just a derpy looking Pokemon, and I I love it. It's great, um, and yeah. Um, real quick, gonna talk about the pseudo legendary because that thing's gonna get on my team at some point. It is literally an ice dragon that's like kind of like a Spinosaurus, if I had to say. Um, it's it's a great Pokemon, great design. I love it. It is on the team. It's gonna get shiny hunted, although. I'm not gonna lie, Shiny's all right, at least from what I remember. Maybe I don't remember it's Shiny very well, but I thought it was a decent Shiny, not the greatest. Um, but yeah, honestly, I cannot wait for these games, and that pseudo is gonna get on the team at some point, for sure. No doubt, I can tell you that right now. Quick keyword, Pokemon, because we're talking about Pokemon. Um, but yeah, uh, and, and honestly, there's a lot of Pokemon in this game that will make my team at some point that I'll play with at least for a little bit. Um, honestly, Lechonk is great. I think that its evolution is all right. Like, I'll probably pick up Lechonk at the beginning and take it through and use it and stuff. Uh, Small Live, not going to be making it on the team, unfortunately. Um, not really a fan of the evolution, and its stats are pretty bad, I believe. I, th I think it has, like, 30 speed, too. It's 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 pretty it's pretty bad, but, um yeah. And then, uh, real quickly, I wanted to talk about some Paradox forms. We got two Pokemon here that... Because um, I'm picking Violet, so we got Hariyama and the Gardevoir Gallade mix. They're like mixed into one Pokemon. Um, so the Hariyama, I just really like the design on it. It's futuristic, um, and I believe it's electric fighting. And then the Gallade, I believe, is still fairy fighting. If I had to say, if I had, I think that's what it is, fairy fighting. Um, maybe I got that wrong. But those two are, are, in my opinion, the two favorite ones from Violet. But I really, really like the Deli Bird one as well. So. Honestly, we'll probably uh, get that um, on the team at some point. We'll probably shiny hunt that soon, too, for the holidays. It, it snowed a lot here. So, quick keyword, snow. It snowed a lot here today. We got, like, four or five inches of snow. Um, and, honestly, like, it, it, it was it was a lot of snow. But um, Deli Bird will be a holiday special kind of shiny hunt. We'll try to get that. Um, it is a paradox form in these games. And, I, and honestly, I kind of like it. I, I kind of like it. I think it does get the water type, though, now, which is pretty interesting. Um, but there's other Pokemon that will make my team. Again, I, I'm not going to show them because, you know, for copyright reasons, for them not taking down my video. But honestly, I cannot wait for these games. I'm th This team, look, typing-wise, I'm not going to lie to you, we got a lot of overlapping typings, right? We got two Pokemon that are literally Fire Ghost, the same exact typing. We have um, an Ice type, and the Pseudo is an Ice type. So we have two Ice types. We got Belly Bolt, which is Electric. But it will probably get dropped from the team eventually. But we got Hariyama, which is electric uh, fighting. We got a uh, ground poison with uh, Claude Sire with the evolution of Wooper. Uh, Gardevoir is fairy fighting, I believe. So that one's pretty good. Um, honestly, uh, what typing are we like really missing from this team? Maybe we need to pick up a dark type, which <laughs> um, I guess. Uh, but there's a lot, a lot of really good, uh, well-designed Pokemon in this game. And there's a couple of Pokemon that I'll pick up for sure. Um, the engine Pokemon is honestly like one Pokemon that will definitely make it on my team at some point. Uh, it's called like Varum or something like that. And it's shiny. It's going to get shiny hunted for sure. It's a really nice shiny. Oh, I forgot Cloth. Cloth is making it on my team for sure. I forgot to put it on here. Cloth, I am shiny hunting for sure, guys. That is, once you guys see the revealed shinies, if you guys haven't seen them yet, shiny Cloth is one of the best shinies in the whole region. So quick keyword, shiny Cloth. I am shiny hunting that till I get it. Uh, for sure, and and some of these Pokemon actually here are, are sh Pokemon I will shiny hunt. Uh, Belly Bolt and Satitan are two Pokemon that I am going to shiny hunt. Um, we we so basically I announced that I'm going to be doing shiny hunting live streams, and that's basically I'm going to be doing resets kind of thing, or just try to get as many encounters as I can with certain Pokemon, just to make sure I get those shinies. And Fido, Belly Bolt, Satitan, uh, the Engine Pokemon, which has a really nice gold shiny. And, um, and Cloth are the five that I mentioned for my first five. Those are like my five first five hunts. Uh, starter, I will hatch eggs for those uh, for Foy Coco. Um, and also, oh, I almost forgot to mention this. Sandwiches apparently give you a shiny boost. So make sure you make some sandwiches. Uh, go full Subway on it. Quick keyword Subway. I, I posted on my story. I'm like, I'm going to turn into like a Subway worker in this game because I will be making sandwiches if it's going to boost my shiny odds. And um, you can check it out on my story um, for for because the, basically the way it works is like certain sandwiches burst, uh, boost certain typings. So 
Uh, certain typings will need, you know, certain sandwich to get shiny boosted. Uh, but honestly, I cannot wait for these games. These games are so close. And uh, make sure, again, you, you guys come and join the live streams because we're going to be having a lot of fun on there. And, um, you know, hopefully you guys come join, say hi, uh, play along with me. I know you guys are definitely going to be playing this game because it's such it looks like such a good game. So uh, come ahead and play along with me. Um, you know, type in the chat, just say what's up, um, and we can play along. And, and again, if you want to do co-op, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, quick key word is going to be ice type. Guys. We got a nice type, but honestly, the, the, the pseudo is a really cool design. Uh, I think a lot of you guys are probably going to have that pseudo on your team, not just because it's strong, just because it's a cool design as well. Um, and then there's a, there's a lot of Pokemon I really like in this region. I think, I think like I said, like this is just like, as you can see here, I'm, I'm having trouble choosing anyways. This is more than six Pokemon on the screen, and I talked about the pseudo that's going to be on my team, you know, so like, it, it's going to be tough. There's, there's going to have to be in and outs on the team, you know, subbing in, subbing out, you know, <laughs> but uh. Uh, definitely, definitely gonna have a lot of fun with this game, and I cannot wait for it to come out. We will shiny hunt a bunch, and like I said, cloth, oh, beautiful shiny, beautiful shiny. Um, honestly, such a good shiny. Um, so Titan gets like a gray shiny as well. Pretty nice. Quick keyword gray, and and usually ice types get really really bad shinies. Honestly, so Titan did not get um a bad shiny. I really like it, and. Uh, yeah, honestly, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. This is just me talking about my team and, and the games in general because I'm just so excited. Like, I, I cannot wait to make more Pokemon Scarlet and Violet content, but not just that. Like, I just, I can't wait to just play this game, play these games. I mean, honestly, and, and hopefully I can play with a couple of you guys. I mean, you guys, honestly, I just want to say real quick, thank you all for the support. Quick keyword support because you guys have been incredible with the support, honestly. I, I thank you guys so much. Um, you guys have really, really helped us, like, boost the channel lately and, and I just really want to say thank you. Like we're we're over, uh, uh, you know, um, one thousand one hundred subs. We're on our way to one thousand two hundred. Like let's get it. Like let's try to hit thirteen hundred by the end of the year. Make sure to smash that uh like button. You know, subscribe button and all that. Um, turn notifications on so you know when we're streaming. Um, we're gonna be streaming this game a lot. I will be posting schedules for it. But um, first things first. I I want to say is we're probably gonna be streaming uh, a lot Friday and Saturday, like a whole lot because I do. Um, I am going to be traveling to my, my mom's house for Thanksgiving for a week from Sunday all the way to next Sunday. So for a week, we'll be off the streams. Um, we'll still have daily videos, so make sure you guys are checking on the channel. Um, but then once we get back, streams all the time. We're going to be streaming a lot. Um, but yeah, hopefully, again, you guys uh, did enjoy this video. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, what Pokemon are you definitely bringing on your team? I'm telling you right now, if you don't bring the Whooper Evolution, that is a travesty. That thing is amazing. Claude Sire is a W. Uh, <laughs> but a quick keyword is going to be Paul Day and Wooper. I think we used Wooper as a, a as a keyword before. Um, but yeah, make sure make sure you guys you know just have fun with these games. Um, don't like you know get too much into it. Don't like you know try to find what's wrong. Just have fun. That's what that's what that's my opinion for you guys. Um, I, I think that these games are incredible. Like they look incredible. They look like fun. I've heard good reviews, and I cannot wait. Um, we'll see. We'll see how the games go, though. We'll see if we can get some shinies. Boost the shiny odds again. Remember with those sandwiches. Um, so make sure you guys, you know, uh, whip up those sandwiches like it's Subway. And uh, quick keyword is gonna be Harayama. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.